I'm Claire Laycock and on the 10th of May, my colleagues at Real News and I put out a video where I spoke about what happened when I was working for my former employers, the TSSA and GMB unions. The reaction to the video has been overwhelming in terms of support, testimony from other women, corroboration of my and other women's stories. The TSSA attempted to take legal action. The injunction applied to Real News was lifted a few days after by the judge at the High Court and my injunction was lifted when I received a notice of discontinuance a few days ago, which means that the TSSA are no longer pursuing the injunction against me. They are to hold an independent inquiry into sexism and improper behaviour in the union. No one has spoken to me or any other survivors about it yet, but we want to meet with the TUC before they speak to the TSSA about the terms of the investigation. TSSA tried to stop me from speaking and they weren't successful in doing that. NDAs are supposed to be used to protect company information, company data, trade secrets. They were never supposed to be used to cover up sexual abuse, sexual violence, sexual harassment in the workplace, especially when they are the reasons that a person had to leave their job. I'm going to continue to speak. I'm going to continue to support other women to speak to end sexual violence in trade unions so we can get on with our work and so we can hold employers to account with a clear conscience. Come forward, join me to you, share your testimony if you feel comfortable. If you don't, just come along and support the other women who are going to. We've heard from women from all of the biggest unions in the country and some of the smaller ones. We've heard from women within the Labour Party and we want to help those women come together. Me to you has set up a crowdfunder which we invite people to contribute to if they feel able. That money will go towards supporting women who want to tell their stories and then experience difficulties whereby they need legal representation and to help them overcome any other obstacles they feel that there is to speaking out.